porn star tried to expose him, ends up ruining her own life. No, I did see a little bit of this shit, but I ain't see like fully. But look though, this I'm gonna just so say this. A situation yes. Hold on, let me speak. This this bitch is actually like crazy, bro. You don't do work with no porn stars, bro. What happened to DeAndre Aiden, Zion Williamson, Commando, bro? She's a goofy, but kind of like you know you're not supposed to be fucking with like porn stars, though, bro. Like this is a porn star, not only fan. This is a porn star. It's a difference, kind of. So there was a situation yesterday where streamer Kai Sinat was basically being held ransom, virtually Kai that Sinat. is, by an OF girl slash corn star named Layla Red. These two apparently had a relationship at some point last year after he met her during a stream. Hey, where you at? You ain't here with me? I'm in the A2. Oh, not with me though. This nigga's hard. No, that's not, that's this nigga's this nigga's hard. He's 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 hard. I'm not dick watching though. Pause. I'm not a dick inspector, but I just know he is. That I don't help, but. So we here. I'm gonna pull up on you. Say on God. And I guess things eventually got deeper for them. And now she is using their time together to try and publicly extort one of the biggest streamers right now. But she's so dumb that she didn't use the blackmail against him correctly. She skipped way too many steps and went right to trying to expose him to the public. Not to even mention this man made oh, my eyes fuck. her sign an NDA, so a lot of what she has done is oh, yeah, she's over with, she's saying things like Kai owes her hush money and that he allegedly even paid for her to sleep with him. Well, I mean, since I'm going to court, I might as well leak the news, the addy, the videos. The what? Since I'm going to court, I might as well leak the nudes that Did she say nudes? Nah, bro. Scary time, scary world, bro. This bitch talking about leaking nudes, bro. She talking... Oh, my goodness, bro. She tried to leak... No. Please. Stop. Nigga, I already know she lost, though, bro. NDA, you look spelled, bro. It's over. The Addy, the videos... Bet you gotta hit that link in my bio. Video coming soon. This woman reminds me a lot of that other corn star that tried to expose Zion Wick. I was just talking about that shit, bruh. Me and this nigga think like, what's his name? Jamanji? Damn, my bad. Jamari. Me and him think exactly the same, bro. But I'd rather fuck Mariah Mills, bro. Like, but still though like Simpson damn. last year and went on that ridiculous Twitter tirade where she made herself look absolutely horrible in the process all in an attempt to expose Zion that bitch was out here tagging the NBA NBA I have sex tips for me and Zion Williams to me I saw, and he also has them on his shop phone trade him now he doesn't deserve to be in the <laughs> yo bitch he is a 6 7 200 and something pounds power of Ford that has a 47 inch vert. You think Adam Sandler, or was it Adam Silver Sandler? That bald nigga, is gonna listen to a porn star? So this ain't about, this ain't even about Zion, this is about Kai, come on, skip. Hey, and Adam Silver and shit, talking about she did a tornado trick on his eggplant, and Whoa. look at my boy Zion now, balling out once again. Now when it comes to Kai, he did the best thing possible and immediately responded to these allegations and it turned into a pretty great reverse uno moment. So this was the initial post that I saw about this situation. She came forward with this via Twitter where I guess she was pretty much trying to promote her Dude, OFK. she is not like bad. I'm sorry. Juice World's ex-girlfriend do recently. I mean, y'all know these OF girls are absolutely shameless. They'll do anything to get that dollar. And obviously, I'm not going to show you these pictures because they're actually revenge corn, obviously. But she says, full video of me and Kai Sinat, link in bio. It was so good, too. And let's be honest, guys. If you see your favorite streamer or rapper or some sort of entertainer famous person got their tape exposed on the timeline, if your first thought is to run and go watch it, to run and go pay for it, you need to seek some sort of... Yo, nah, that's nah, that's actually true though. If if like your favorite, like whatever, bro, got the sex tape leak, bro, and it's a nigga, and you're a nigga too, and you go and watch that shit, some it's not for the bitch, bro. You trying to see if that nigga got, got got a good stroke game. Somebody have to say it, and I'm gonna be the one to say it. You dick inspecting, you trying to watch your favorite whatever, blah blah blah. Fuck, mainly because of him. You trying to see if he got that shit. What happened when Drake shit got leaked? 
All the Drake Decker out of time, but I ain't gonna lie, he's packing. Go to psychiatric help. She also says when kinda what to do when you come around. And this is where this $5,000 Apple payment allegation comes from where she claims he was paying for the goodies. Now this is Kai's initial response. He would go on to absolutely flame her throughout the day. Here he's showing his Apple payment history. She saved as Layla Red in my phone. On oh God, you're saved as Layla Red in my phone. Kiara Rush, I'm on you now. Kiara Rush, we don't, we call you KR now. All right, go to November. Stop, stop. So as you guys can see, they're in the Apple Pay history. Lay the red for $50, okay? And I guess he's basically trying to say here, no, I did not pay to smash some old retired corn star turned OF washed up woman. All I paid for was the trip home. Lay the red, $50 for your fucking dumb ass Uber, bitch. I got you a fucking Uber, bitch. $50, bitch. What did you talk about? Now, this is acceptable for him to get loud, though, so I ain't gonna do it. So obviously, I, I was beyond outraged in this situation. And he's really trying to go the Except extra the mile to not only clear his name, but to also expose this corn star. And I guess this was her response to him saying that all when he- When the biggest streamer in the world pay for pussy and lie to hide the truth, LOL. This is like, oh my, I'm not even, I'm blocking her name and shit. I mean, it don't really matter. She's probably MIA everywhere now. But gee, this is the big, bro. Oh my God. When you at a certain level, bro, you can't fuck with certain bitches, bro. Especially porn stars, bruh. They already have no dignity. Let's just keep it a buck, though. <clears throat> Let's keep it a buck. They got no dignity, bro. Like, bro. If they get caught with you, bro, even if it's a leaked picture, anything, bro, any pic, bro, publicity, bro, they're gonna milk the fuck out that bitch, bro. Huh? What he paid for was the Uber, which she says, when the biggest streamer in the world pay for and lie to hide the truth lol she would then go on to share this message grown men pay for p and listen guys i know they say all the time to not judge a book by its cover but if we can learn anything from the last couple videos i've made it's that sometimes you have to use your brain and you can just literally sometimes see a woman Look, to the last guy. and know what they're all about now here's where she continues to post this photo of Kaisenat nude in bed. It looks like she took this picture while this man was sleeping, and he basically has his junk out. And yes, this would qualify as revenge corn. She says, trying to sue me after buying p is wild. LOL, you go into jail too, clown. You breached the contract, and so did I. Guess your bitch ass a be in a cell right next to me. And she would even take to TikTok to drop this video response to Kai. Now, Everybody keep asking though. me about all the dates, all the dates. See, he's not showing y'all shit from this year. I showed y'all last year and this year. He's just showing y'all last year and he's showing from another iCloud. See, that's how dumb people is. It's a whole nother iCloud, shorty. I'm showing proof from our most recent leak up which was three weeks ago. Now, to be fair to her, do I think that someone with as much money clout and status as kai sanat would only have one phone that he's doing apple pay on absolutely not where he paid me to delete anything that i had on him which was the agreement and i was cool with that wait so did he pay you to delete information about him or did he pay you to sleep with him because oh he's cooking this nigga is cooking bitch you just fucked yourself up man but let me not get too early, though. Speak too soon. Because you're alleging two different things right now. Your story really is not adding up. You got to understand, like, I'm in the industry. Everything I get is insurance. Period, point blank. I don't know y'all. I don't give a f And I'm going to always protect myself at the end of the day. So, yes, I did collect insurance. You damn right. Just like he did when he recorded my voice. And the insurance she's talking about is all these different materials that she had to expose him. Like that picture of him laying naked asleep in bed. I mean, when it comes to Kai, he was just an absolute idiot for messing around with someone like this. Like the saying is yeah, very I... true. You lay down with dogs and you're likely going to get fleas. <laughs> to act like you didn't <laughs> pay me, bitch. Now you got me up and now I got to expose you. So basically what this woman is saying is that she wants to be viewed as a hooker. She wants to be viewed as someone who is down for the pay for play. I don't think that's the flex that she thinks it is. No, nah, that I is it's a flex. I the transaction ID for the payment that you just recently made to me. I mean, does anyone really care if Kai went out and was tricking on this chick? Absolutely not. Entertainers, athletes, people of status, 
They're doing this stuff every single day to all kinds of women. Normal women, industry women, corn stars. I mean, for these type of chicks, I have to believe that's kind of- Five bands though? I ain't paying five bands to pay. You feel me? Five bands is crazy, bro. Just give me that five bands. Give me that five bands, bro, and I might give me a camera. First thing, first what I'm doing when I, if I do get the five bands, bro, that sounds crazy as shit to say, cause it makes sound like, no. I'm just saying though, that five bands, if I had it in my pocket, nigga, I'm probably getting the camera. Like an actual camera, so in case I ever want to vlog, you know, I don't have to, you feel me, hit my homies up. And, uh, I'm a black nigga. I might buy me a fit, post on Instagram on some shit, you feel me? And probably just say the rest type shit. Yeah, bro. I ain't gonna cap, bro. I'm like their whole game. Stop acting like you don't know why I'm doing this right now. Everything was cool until you didn't want to pay me my money, my hush money. And that's when it became a problem you made this a problem i can't lie to you guys this has to be one of the dumbest individuals that we've ever seen on my Hush channel me. like she's trying to expose him but the whole time she's just exposing herself and her potential mini crimes thank you for giving yourself another charge dumb bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she... she even went out of her way to leak this man's number all right here's the screen record for you guys up now damn message well, didn't have to lie. And this clip right here would actually result in her getting banned from Instagram, which I'm sure like all the other OF girls, when it comes to promoting her page, you know, OF and Instagram go together like bread and butter. That's where they lure in all the simps. Now that's the Twitter. If I got my money, I would have shut up. Well, you're definitely not going to get your money now, chick. As a well, matter of fact, I think you're going to be sending portions of your paycheck to Kai Sanat for quite some time. And honestly, crashing out over like 5,000 bucks is definitely not f***ing worth it. Now, this is where Kai Sanat really yeah, as a, 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 a porn star situation. too, it's crazy. He took a page out of 50 Cent's book, and he's being extra petty with the people trying to play with his name. So, Layla, I have bought your domain. Now, you might ask, what does that mean, Kai? It means every time somebody Damn this nigga is he mm, Nah his room's gonna wide it out bro I'm tired of this nigga though for sure Somebody types in Piera Rush. Anytime somebody types in Layla Red, the first website that they will click on is all the lies you've told me, all the crimes you've done, all the dumb shit you just put yourself. Nigga took her domain. Up your life. So no, your OF link won't pop. Then nigga gets on some Jujutsu Kaisen <laughs> no, shit. No, or anything like that won't pop up first. Oh no 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 no. The top link will be Piera Rush. Okay. 17.9 million views. So obviously the man Damn, is playing Twitter checkers. Pages are... This woman is out here not even Shit. playing checkers, okay? This bitch is playing like tic-tac-toe. And this is what you see when you go to these websites that Kai Sanat set up. Kiara Rush dot com. <gasps> oh my god! We Damn. got you, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Every single clip for anybody who messes up? Oh wait, I don't know that was real name. Hold on, we don't know it. <laughs> oh no. <gasps> no matter what. Damn, that bitch is going bankrupt. Yo, oh my goodness, I'm actually happy. I'm happy as shit, bro. Some a, a bitch got humbled, bro. Let's go. Oh, let's fucking go, bro. And it was kind to do it, bro. You know what? I ain't gonna lie. Short niggas are kind of winning, bro. Not saying I'm short, but if you call me a short nigga, though, I guess that fit that category, bro. Nick, you know the niggas are winning, bro. Fuck it. But he took her domain, bro. I like to see it, though, bro. Bitch try to play with a nigga for no reason, bro. Like, what is you doing, bro? Hush money and shit. Like, come on. For the rest of your life, this... Five bands? Are you serious? Be hair i mean i won't lie to you guys that is a pretty damn good power play right there and apparently Ka but this is what she tried to do i noticed what she tried to do bro she wanted to she wanted to show about the five bands but she kind of was that five bands but then what she was really thinking in her mind she knows she wasn't really super tri tripping about the five 
But see, time about yo, if I do expose this shit and I get exposure, boom. Now, like, my name's attached to Kai for this, that. They're gonna check my shit out. They're gonna check my P Hub, my all that. Oh, that. Now it's over with, bro. Stop being your meat, bro. These, these are the bitches y'all not to, bro. Shit. I was even out here smoking on that Layla Red Pack, dancing around. I don't know, this whole shit is hilarious. I mean, she really thought she was gonna make him look bad, and she really kinda just turned this into a W for him. And then she has the audacity to try and allege some very serious allegations against him, even if it's a little bit tongue-in-cheek here. Oh, we taking people to court? Well, she I'm ready to take you to court, little P. Diddy Jr. You talking about you trying to sell me to one of your homies and all that shit? Don't forget about I got all that in the teeth too. So she's calling him Nah, she sounds like she's losing her brain cells, though. Timmy, I don't believe this. Let me give it a buck with you. Not because I'm a dick rider. I'm not a dick rider at all. But I'm saying, though, does she not sound like she's losing her? She's talking like, yeah, okay, let's do it then. Bro, back up, please. You got, bro, like, it's so crazy. You're posting on TikTok and everywhere, bro. Back up, please. Hey, Diddy's crazy shit. Taking people to court? What well, shit? I'm ready to take you to court, little P. Diddy Jr. You talking about you trying to sell me to one of your homies and all that shit? Don't forget about I got all that in the teeth too. So she's calling him P. Diddy Jr., insinuating that he is a trafficker because he went to one of his boys and told people what she's all about. I mean, clearly she prides herself on being pay for play, but now she wants <laughs> to act like it's some sort of Diddy situation when it's convenient what for the her. Fuck? That doesn't really make a lot of sense. Come on now, y'all. That's... I say it's kind of normal because I ain't getting no ass yet, but it is not bro. If there's a bitch that's going and you crack and I tell my homie and my homie's like, who's this? And he hit me up. I'm going to tell him, yo, nah, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Get on that. She going, bro. How is that selling, nigga? What the fuck? That is not selling, bro. That is not selling. And you can't say selling too at all if that nigga did not pay you 5000 to fuck. How is it selling? How can you say sell if nigga did not pay you at all to begin with, bro? How does that make sense? If that's allegedly, bro. This bitch is stupid. In what way is it selling? It's more like he just telling motherfuckers, yo, I ain't gonna lie, bro. She going, she got that shit. That's normal, bro. I, I'm gonna keep it with you. That's normal as shit. I don't care what no one said. That's normal. It's so stupid, bro. Shit. Yeah, actually, I am stupid bitch. Y'all, of course he was gonna come back with a story saying he gonna sue me. How else was he gonna look good to the vlog? I mean, you like a certified trick right now. Duh. And you're what? A certified hooker and proud of it? truly do not understand how an individual can be this low IQ. I mean, just look at the face there. It's not screaming Harvard yeah, graduate. Like... But I want to know what you guys think <laughs> about this situation down below. Just based on the way the two of them are talking, I think that Kai really does have the checkmate here if he really wants it. And I think he is going to exercise his option to be as petty as possible for a very long time against this woman. Like at the end of the day, we know that people who have excess amounts of money and excess amounts of fame are likely paying for women to be with them in one way or another. Even if it's not like a physical money payment thing, it might be a status thing. It might be a Birkin bag thing. I'm just saying this type of situation is not rare. This thing is 6 9 is... I think it's a top troll, bro. If you still bump 6 9 to this day, bro. <laughs> I mean, shit, you should get a suit too, fuck. For it all. But y'all let me know what you guys think about all of this down below. As always, also want to thank you guys for watching today's video, dropping a like and subscribing. But as you guys know, it's been your boy, the Tan Superman, and some other money and clout chase and thoughts out here need to be covered. So I'm out. Peace. Hey, W video, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I'm gonna say this, G. That bitch, Layla Red, Kiara Rush, whatever. I ain't going bad, bro. You lost, bro. First of all, once you sign that NDA, it's practically over, with, bro. You breached the contract. That's just facts, though, bro. And, you know, bro, she did that.